happiness. It's a cookie your own mind bakes. Top inspired by the YouTubes. Again, the uh, YouTube channel is uh, Lex Friedman. Friedman. I believe he's Russian. And I was watching one of his videos right now and artificial about artificial intelligence happiness. But uh, that was one of the um, one of the highlights made by one of his guests. Hold <clears throat> on, my corona's flaring up. And now that um, that statement of happiness, you know, it, it gets to me because. As much as I, as much, as much or as little as I've done, or the variety of it, different sorts of experiences. <clears throat> no, I'll sum it up with this. Uh, I can't put it in words, but now I know there's one homeless person. I don't know if it's in fat man or a fat woman and uh, see them sleep on the same bus stop beat up shoes um, in a walker with a walker on their side um, in front of their feet on the side of their legs and and just sleeping just knocked out I mean, for me to go to sleep, I need to be either very comfortable or very tired. <clears throat> but to sleep on a bus stop, a bus bench, I don't know if that one had any different. I don't even think that one had any uh, shelter over it. So I think of another friend who, you know, this dude, uh, this friend of mine, he, he didn't have it uh, easy in life. He had a lot of challenges. And he, he still keeps on getting after it. And uh, we, when we would, uh, you know, dissect hardship in people, and he just say, yeah, poor cunt. Poor cunt. That's just be, that would just be describing um, you know, the situation, man. <clears throat> you know, but when I see that person, you know, I, I just think poor cunt. And start thinking about socialism, communism. We need to charge everyone a 99% tax on all income so that no one else sleeps on the street. But there's AC and uh, basically a big barracks. A big um, jail pod for everyone to sleep in. And, and it's a uh, twist of emotions 
Gandhia, Lexa, Friedman, Gasta. Something, something was said of. Um, so, he'll, so he'll, some people lose. Um, <coughs> I didn't say better. It's mother word. But we think happiness should be a certain way where. Uh, your own perspective needs to be absolutely other people need to um to see it that way or else you're disturbed or or you don't like them <laughs> you know there was a time in my life where You would have a hard time to say if you were caught saying, Oh, my feet hurt. Oh my goodness, I need a break. Does this place have air conditioning? You, know, you wouldn't hear shit about Is this organic, vegan, gluten free? Fuck that. Get it done. It's edible. <laughs> not, not even digestible for oh, for that's nutrients. It's edible. On the main card, I was taught to be. I was taught um, that I was a puppy that barely learned how to um, jog on his four feet. <coughs> After swimming with other men that in Inca we call them salty. Serving with with warriors, you know, and put the uh, the the level up, the the bar up, the standard, the definition, um, the volume or the intensity. <clears throat> so many things. And, and I think of happiness a lot because, uh, you know, when I got out, when I chose to get out to Marine Corps, my dumb ass thought, hey, you know, um, the Marine Corps is um, pretty much left, right, left, one, two, three, five, six, seven, one foot in front of the other, just get it done. Obviously, the world works like that. And uh, no, and as you could tell in 2020, uh, my pussy hurts. Um, the color of my skin is keeping me from getting promoted. Um, don't use those words. Um, you need to hire me because of uh, my vagina. The color of my skin. That show, that show, that joke is, um, just rate me, shut up. And, uh, it's a, it's a culture shock, man. Because I was born and raised in America. I'm like, what the fuck?
Uh, there's no chain of command out here. And I um, quickly had to uh, had to think. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, well, what's happiness now? What's what's the mission? The objective? How can you get to happiness? To success? What is that? How do I get it done? <clears throat> I think uh, if you watch the YouTube channel Timcast, and you'll see some of the some of the amazing things that uh, that are happening or even possible. And. Uh, you know, they're they're energy draining just just like right now as I think of uh, I'm trying to think one one story that I recently heard on Tim Cass where a college professor is on leave for saying I'm trying to think what the uh, what the Chinese um, equal of the word is. But it's something like, mm hmm, let me see, do, 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 do. as you're making a choice. And it's Nai, Nai Ga. And students complained that they were offended, saying that it was like, nigga, nigga, black. And now the, the professor's on leave, man. I believe it was a USC professor, a business professor, so not even like a. A language guy. So. But yeah, I try to find the. Uh, let me clean this up. Try to adjust and calibrate my um my level of happiness. Because I know there's just so many factors. Someone asked me the other day, do I miss it? Do I miss it? And I said, man. Do I miss it? <clears throat> and I, and I, and we'll bring up some of the points that I had just mentioned. I remember seeing a YouTube video. Uh, some uh, students are telling that. Uh, saying this man, hey, I need two volunteers to uh, handle something. One Marine goes, volunteers for what? I need one more volunteer. <laughs> and, uh, Yeah, that's it now. Get it done. Well, see, that's not right, man, you know, because, you know. What if the person has um, plans and. What if they have a bump knee or sore back or. They already made plans to go to dinner with somebody. Get it done. You know, out here in the world, in the really real world, well, fuck your emotions. Fuck you, actually. Fuck your existence because you know, people really don't care about uh, your existence, generally speaking. Well, my grandma says I'm number one. Generally speaking, motherfucker.
and I've just seen you know, various times where people try to I guess show toughness, verify that they're strong or some shit. And I think uh, Jocko Goggins, Goggins had mentioned this thing was Goggins, David Goggins. You know, would just even prep uh, courses so that you get ready for buds. Well, they eventually calculated that eventually with these courses, all they basically did was create a bigger, stronger quitter. I wonder what that secret sauce is that makes you keep on going. Me, I, me, I do find it challenging with um, either living, being amongst, working with people who are don't feel but fulfill their potential, complain, nag. Um, to think for natural selection, the selection. Empathy. I think empathy is a big dangerous word now. I had a nephew the other day, uh, bump his knee, fucking around, um, horsing around, playing. And this kid, three years old, falls and uh, scrapes his knee. And I didn't go over there and say, oh man, you're all right, you're gonna make it, man down. Compound fracture, no. I forget what I did actually because I, I knew that when I saw that I was like I'm not I can't uh, let them think that hurts or or that to for them to label that as a a level of pain or a barrier or a limit because to me to me it was critical. Go get the ball again, or let's just go over here and play. Move it. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And then someone had mentioned, uh, oh man, are those, are those your kids? Or like, I was thinking, motherfucker, if I had kids, they wouldn't be around you. Fucking weenie. You know, I also thought about happiness in, in that sense where I thought, man, I think if I had kids, I would be a ner nervous wreck, man. Ain't no piece of shit or a weakling. You know, gonna, my kids are going to observe you from, <laughs> from a safe clown distance. With a ten foot pole, man. Don't want your fucking stupidity, weakness, nagging, contaminating, contaminating the chosen one. That's it for now, motherfuckers. Get after it. Go forward. Trump 2020. There are no easy days. Simply days where potential was not fulfilled. <laughs>